Right. Hey, I'm Jim Martin. Jennifer Welch. And uh, we're with uh, Pasco Happenings, the Jim and Jen show. That's right. We've got an exciting day today. I'm pretty fired up about it. I am too because we're actually at a place in Newport Ritchie called Chocolates by Michelle. And I just have to hold up a couple of things right, right. so everybody can see Absolutely. the cool stuff. Absolutely. Okay, so check this out. Little tiny chocolate heart box. Very cool. Filled with little tiny chocolates. And, okay, this is really funny. A chocolate boyfriend. I saw, I saw, I saw that. In Better yet, a chocolate, chocolate girlfriend. girlfriend right? Yes. That's um, hilarious. All kinds of hand-dipped chocolates here at the shop. And it uh, smells so good. It does. And chocolate-dipped strawberries and chocolate-dipped pretzels and actually chocolate-dipped bacon. <laughs> yeah, it did really? I didn't you know? see that. Yeah, I tried some. Did you? I'm yeah. going to have to try it. It was really good, actually. <laughs> that sounds yeah. crazy. It is crazy, but it's good. It's also nice and cool in here, so in our wicked winters that we have at 85 degrees right now, you bust in here, it'll be a nicer way to, yeah, to cool off. Oh, my goodness. Um, so, hey, upcoming events. Pasco County. Big deal, the Pasco County Fair, mm -hmm. which is coming up the 20th through the 26th. I think we're going to try to get out there. Yeah, that's but next week. It is next week. Yeah, is that... Uh, I think it's what Monday or Sunday through. It goes, starts on Monday and it'll go through the, through the week. following week, yes, right? So, holy cow, what's out there again? The rodeo. The rodeo, the grizzly bear, or yeah. the, the the bear thing, <laughs> that's right, right? That's right. Um, all the fair rides and the, the food? best part, the food. Come on, <laughs> right? Exactly. That's what I look forward to. That's most. where you have to get the food. Right. Get some snapshots of that. Um, also coming up uh, February 23rd through the 26th out in Dade City is the um, combined driving event okay. that is actually sponsored by the Little Everglades uh, Steeple Chase, and that is a horse racing organization. Okay. They're a not-for-profit organization, and this event apparently is huge. Really? So uh, yeah, I don't. I've really never been to too many horse racing or riding events. No. But I know we watch like the big things, like Kentucky Derby and stuff right. like that on TV. I really want to go out and check this out. Um, That'd be pretty cool. Usually my so horse racing neat. events are at the track. I take a pocket full of cash. I come home with no cash, <laughs> and it's not the greatest day of the week. <laughs> it's a bad <laughs> night at Jim's house. <laughs> right, right, right. I don't know. Sounds, sounds pretty, pretty cool. Yeah. Yeah, we ha actually have a, a big blog uh, post about this on our website, PascoHappenings.com. And okay. uh, I just thought it was really neat, and yeah. uh, that everybody should be made aware of it. That's pretty awesome. When was that? That was the. 23rd through the 26th? Yes. Yep. All right, very cool. Uh, this Monday is President's Day. That's right. And while most of America will have that day off, including all the schools, Paso County's out, um, banks will be closed, probably the post office. Uh, we'll still be at work. We're working that day if anybody has a day <laughs> off. So uh, that's coming up this Monday. Yep. And now the big news. Right, yes. Okay, so we're going to announce the winner of our very first Pasco Happenings Valentine's Day Sweetheart Challenge, and I am so excited to tell everybody that the winners are Rebecca and Mark Roberts, and they sent the most amazing email to us about their Valentine's Day they really did. date night. It was actually a family date night, and it was so sweet and creative, and to us, really, when we look through the email, it pretty much embodied the entire meaning of Valentine's it Day did. at every level. Right. So I'm looking forward to uh, letting them know that they won. Yes, yeah, that's And cool. they're going to get a $50 gift card to the restaurant of their choice in Pasco County. And we're also going to post a really nice article about their family and a few pictures on our Facebook page Fantastic. and on PascoHappenings.com. But they had a real special night with their two daughters. And, uh, oh, it was just so sweet. It was. It did. was. They, um, it was, A, she did a great job writing the letter. Yes. B, we want to thank everybody who made the submissions. Yes. They were all good. Um, and then thirdly, um, to the winners of this year, next Valentine's Day, you be sure to invite us because the food they cook was all on my favorites list too. Yes, let me just tell you, they they did use all their fine china right. and set their dining room table very very fancy and special. They made they have two daughters. They made each other all all of them made each other's favorite foods, which was cool. So it was like a giant beautiful buffet of everyone's favorite things to eat. And earlier that day, um, Mark cooked breakfast for his family. 
they had a, all had a special lunch together, and then the really nice family dinner. That's cool. And um, I, I'll yeah. throw another fifty dollar gift card in next year if I get to show up. <laughs> to eat, dinner, they right? have like steak in and addition to whatever tail we do, and all yeah. kinds of stuff. Yeah, so, sign me up for uh, that program. I know, no kidding. So if anybody out there wants great ideas to do for Valentine's Day or just a special night with your family or your sweetheart. Make sure you read this article that we're going to post about their special night together. Absolutely. So congratulations to Rebecca and Mark. We look forward to getting in touch with you so that you can enjoy your gift certificate. Let's do it. Well, let's wrap this thing up because I want to go back there and uh, eat some chocolate and make some chocolate, That's which right. is coming up in our next segment. That's right. And thanks for being here.